Good morning, YouTubers, friends, and family. RV Debs here. It's Wednesday. Kind of overcast in the 50s, but not bad. All the new people that have joined my channel, thank you for subscribing. This is the property I live on. It's pretty rough right now because the winter, all the, the grass looks terrible. But we do get beautiful green grass and all of our, that's a pecan tree. But it's pretty barren right now. I wanted to show you where I lived. I know most of you have seen it, but hey, new people. Got to welcome, in, welcome them into my home. This is my RV carport and the way I get to live, although it's a little messy. There's our chickens. Yeah, tell us. Good morning. Good morning, girls. How are ya? Hello, Red. Good morning, ladies. Yes, you're such good girls. Noisy. What? What's going on out there? I know. There's my two dogs running around. Because back here, that's the community center. And then there's five full RV hookups for people visiting our little town. Everything looks different in the winter, for sure. So I sit out here, usually I'll walk with the dogs, or sometimes, when it's quiet, I just sit here on my favorite spot. All these leaves blew in from all the wind we had, it just tore off the trees. Come on, girls. So anyway, I'm just starting my day, gonna make some coffee. And uh, I'm wearing my sweater. I bought this one at Target recently. It's long. It, it covers like pretty much a full length sweater. It's not too thick. It's good. Just right. Rosie, come. Lily, come. Here comes Rosie. Come on. You ready for your cookies? You are. Every morning they get um, a chicken jerky that's just got two ingredients. It's basically chicken. Yeah. That's breakfast for them and coffee for me. There's Lily. <laughs> yep. World just keeps going and going, doesn't it? Good morning. Good morning, YouTubers and friends. Family, RV Dubs here. Whew, it's Thursday morning, about 10 a.m. Skies look a lot nicer today than yesterday. It's supposed to get up to the mid 70s, which is good. It just always changes. Ooh, it's a nice wind though. I like it. Comfy. Hurry up, Rosie. Come on. Come here. Anyway, got to make some coffee. I got to go to the post office and mail some jewelry off that was bought on my Etsy shop, which I want to thank you guys so much. So very much. Hope you love the pieces you got. Good afternoon, friends. 
Um, I am at the post office. I'm sitting here because um, the lady ahead of me had like boxes going overseas and it takes a long time. So I just thought I'd sit in my car for at least 10 minutes and that's when I thought, well, I'm gonna say hello to you guys. So I'm sitting here at the post office because I have four um, packages to send off. And I wanna thank the people that are supporting my channel so much. Not just buying it from Etsy, but in general, just being there for me. But I wanna thank special shout out to Joanne in Canada. And um, Nan and Ted are both in New York, New York City type area, I think. Thank you so much. And uh, Darby in St. Petersburg, Florida, who's been buying necklaces and doing some sweet things. All of you have done some great things for me to lift my spirits. I'm trying to fight depression. I am doing the best I can to just keep going. Uh, my new channel has 600 and I think it was 604 subscribers last time I looked, which is really amazing. I'm trying to get to a thousand subscribers, so please try to share the videos with other people. Just share them and see if anyone finds me and wants to hang out with me and be a part of my channel. I'm very grateful to all of you that are here. I don't know what happened to the other 4,500 subscribers that were on my channel. I hope they find me and come back. I did hear from uh, I did hear from YouTube. The guy at YouTube that is my uh, my go-between. I don't know what you want to call him. And he's very nice. He's very kind. And he understands because I wrote him a letter. I, I, I was seeing my videos disappearing on this channel that hacked my channel. A whole year. Like the whole last year, those videos were there. They're no longer there. And my playlists are gone, which were there. And so now it starts with videos a year ago. So I wrote him a letter and I said, oh my God, you know, is that you guys? Are you pulling my my uh, videos off, you know, slowly? But the email that I got, uh, Calvin, he said uh, not to worry. They're working as hard as they can and that each, even though other people have gotten their channels after being hacked quicker, each one is individual. And uh, it just seems to me like in the letter, he was saying that they don't really have the control over the channel. I don't know, but he again says they're they're working to get my channel back and clean. That's he even used the word clean. And it's confusing to me that why a, a huge huge company like YouTube and Google haven't got control over all of our videos that they could block us if they wanted to. Like, why are they not able to do that? I don't know. You know, I can ask a million questions and you guys can have a million answers, but we really don't know. So I'm just hanging in there, but I am um, kind of coming to terms that I have to build this, this channel up as much as I can. So again, thank you so much, everybody, for uh, just sticking with me and resubscribing to this channel, sending me cards, sending me sweet gifts and and just buying from my Etsy shop and leaving comments and I know not everybody can afford to help each other financially but just being there for me is beautiful wonderful for me really it is helping me I um I mean I'm depressed I I can't help it I and I know that in this world that we live in th losing this channel is is a big deal for me but compared to losing a loved one or having a home burned to down and losing everything you own or um, someone losing their their income and, and they have a family or kids that are sick or just fighting cancer or all that stuff is really what's difficult and important and and depressing and it's hard so I try I'm trying to take like the high road and say this is this has happened and it's, I'm okay, I'm still alive. And I'm just trying to not feel that feeling, you know, that, that loss. But I've lost a lot worse than this. I just got to keep telling myself that it's just a YouTube channel. That's all. Yeah. 
Anyway, <laughs> I'm sitting here. I'm going to go into the post office now and try to mail these. These are four, four uh, packages. And uh, I'll be talking to you guys later. Thank you so much. Give me a thumbs up. Leave comments. Let me know that you're hanging in there with me. I'm sitting in my workspace. Let me get this lights right. Yeah, well. Anyway, I'm sitting here in the garage where I have my little workspace. I made it a necklace tonight, today. Um, it's 4 o'clock in the afternoon, approximately. This, this necklace is um, not real large beads, real pretty. A lot of um, seed beads, real small ones in between. And it's pretty. All different colors. You can wear this really with anything. There's there's old antique beads. There's new crystals. And there's mother of pearl. There's wood. Glass beads. Anyway, it is 40 inches long. So it's pretty long. One of those, one of those years. <laughs> but it's nice out today. It's in the 70s, high 70s. It's kind of warm, actually. It's perfect, really. It's perfect. No complaints. And um, I'm going to list it on Etsy. Anyway, I hope you like it. And uh, check it out in my Etsy shop, which, of course, there's always a link right below the videos. It says show more. Click that. Not only I, I give you my um, post office box, my um, Facebook Facebook page, RV Deb's Journey, Instagram, PayPal, and uh, Etsy. So I hope you'll stick with me and check out my shop. I'm going to be trying to make more and more and more. I, I've got, because uh, I really sold a lot over the last season, but now I have to refill this is three bracelets I just made. They do have, this one has a little cross on it. Just, I think it's just one cross. But, you know, I just put it in there. I thought it was pretty. But it's got a lot of real pretty beads on them. So, they're listed on Etsy also. And I hope that you're all having a real good day, a real good week. I would be having a better week had I um, heard that my channel was, you know, getting worked on. But, oh well. Just got to take it as it comes, right? But I'm doing okay. I'm hanging in there. I hope you're all hanging in there with me. And I appreciate that. I guess I'm going to... I also have this one for sale. Let me show you because while well, you're here in my workspace. This is all turquoise, teal, um that kind of blues turquoise blues and it's pretty and it's got a couple of turtles on it stars leaves it's a little shorter this one's about i'll have to measure it i think it's like 30 inches maybe let's see if i'm right i'll uh measure it okay It's just 30 inches. I mean, I've gotten so good at it. Maybe you'll, uh, 29. <laughs> yep. I also have this one. This is made on stretchy cord so that you can wear it all right around, you know, easy to wear. No, no, no clasp. I hate to do clasps. Now this necklace is 20 inches. So this is probably 18, but very comfortable. And it, like I said, it, it would match anything. And I, I do like, I've always liked the multicolors. Even when I used all natural gemstones, I used to love using fancy jasper because it comes in all these colors. And there's some fancy jasper in this. Um, so I hope that you um, check out the shop and hope you're having a great week. And I'll probably talk live on Friday. So I'll see you at the live, live chat if you can make it. And I'll talk to you later.